Do you guys spot something in the background? Maybe, like, you know, right over there. Besides the fact that, you know, I got a new background. I rearranged the room a little bit, but there's a G Fuel tower with the uh, <laughs> new G Fuel. I'll go get it. Can you guess what it is? Boysenberry, ladies and gentlemen. I've been waiting for this for a while. It was supposed to be here Saturday. Um, it's Tuesday, but hey, we got it. That's all that matters. And I've heard really good things about it, so hopefully I also enjoy it. I think the box art with G Fuel is always phenomenal. This is the first collector's box I've ever gotten, so I'm very excited about it. Pops right open, there's no tab. This isn't Apple. This is better than Apple. The shaker cup looks great. These are just fun colors, like you got the teal, you got a little bit of the pink, reddish color. It looks good. Then of course, what you've been waiting for, Bobby Boysenberry. I haven't watched anybody else's reviews, I haven't read anything. That is so I have a clear mind and nothing's gonna influence my opinion on this tub or make me think of something. Like, I assume that this is gonna be some raspberry, some purple berry. I don't know, what's a purple berry? Am I just stupid? I feel like I'm just an idiot. Either way, I'm gonna crack this thing open. Oh, yeah, that's a berry of some sort. I mean, clearly, but you wanna sniff sniff that? Take a big sniff, a big whiff of that. <sighs> okay, good. That's good. What'd you smell? Oh, if you smell dog poo, you're incorrect. We have the shaker with the ice. If you couldn't tell. It's like a waterfall, you know? You have to pour your water in the cup in a very fun fashion. It's not fun if you don't. There is entirely too much. Get out! One scooping for the cup. Put a lid back on cup for safe measures. You don't want to spill your G Fuel all over your desk. That'd be a tragedy. And if you do do that, you better scoop it all back up and um, put it back in the tub. You know, this isn't a completely clear cup, but you can see the purple bleeding through. Maybe not on camera. You didn't think we'd forget about the Puma exercises in this new setup, did you? Come on now. Now I can do it a different way. I can actually back the heck up. Oh yes. We got angles for days. One day, this is actually gonna explode and I will cry. Y M C A. Oh God. I think we're good. Mainly because I just got my workout in for the year. This is completely out of left field, but if you took Galaxy Grape and mixed it with Blue Chug Rug, now disclaimer, I've never done that, but I feel like those two smells are what this smells like. You want to smell? <laughs> Sniff it up. If you have some water nearby, some G Fuel nearby, we're gonna cheers in five, four, three, two, one. Okay. Holy crapples. It's definitely berry heavy. Do I know what berry? No. Do I look like I eat berries? No. It's a purple berry. Rasp raspberries are pink. Purple. Pink. Google! Purple berries. What the hell? Oh, it's a boysenberry. You know... I feel like a certified idiot, because boysenberry is a berry. It tastes like boysenberry. It's in the name. I'm not the smartest individual on the planet. I apologize. So besides my initial stupidity, let's actually go over what it tastes like. Besides the fact that it's boysenberry, okay? I'm stupid, I'm sorry, I apologize. The flavor as a whole, when you take a taste, starts off pretty sweet, and then you get a little bit of acid at the end. I prefer Sour G Fuel, like strictly sour G Fuel, like Chug Rug, Sour Cherry, etc. They're all primarily sour flavors. So me personally, I'm not a very sweet G Fuel kind of person. I do like it, okay? I'll, I'll put that out there. I do like it, but I'm not going to have it in like my top five. Me personally, I would rank this an 8 out of 10. That being said, it's a great flavor, especially if you're new and you want to try it out, I would recommend you pick it up. If you like any of the berry flavors, such as Faze Berry, you'll probably like this. If I had to rank the last few G Fuels that I ranked on this channel from about two weeks ago, starting with Ice Shatter, it's gonna be number one. 
Poison Berry is gonna take the number two spot, Galaxy Grape is gonna take the number three spot, and of course, Scorpion Sting is gonna take the last spot. Other than that, that's all I have for you guys today. So if you did enjoy the video, go ahead and drop a like down below. Maybe even subscribe if you want to check out my Twitch streams over on Twitch. The link is in the description down below. It's also The Puma's Revenge if you're curious. Go check it out. We stream every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday around 10 a.m., 11 a.m. Central Time. Other than that, I hope you guys have a fantastic day. Remember to stay hydrated. Stay positive. If you're having a hard day, life gets better. All right? Drink some G Fuel. Drink some water. Anything that stays hydrated, do it. Drink it. As long as it's legal. There's some weird things in this world, okay? Don't do anything stupid, all right? Goodbye!